probably going to find out about it anyway. So here's a little preemptive truth telling. There's no happy ending. One, two, three, four. Oh, no. Chef Anthony Bourdain. Anthony Bourdain. Anthony Bourdain. The renowned chef and best-selling author of Kitchen Confidential. All the TV chefs are so cuddly and adorable, you know, maybe I'm the antidote or something. Has a new program, Parts Unknown. One minute I was standing next to a deep fryer, and the next I was watching the sunset over the Sahara. What am I doing here? I said earlier that I was going to tell you the truth. This is part of it. It was almost never about food. It was about Tony learning how to be a better person. When he threw himself into something, he threw himself completely. Why am I here? Am I insane? He was like, life's about finding a cliff worth jumping off. I'm going to look for something feral and wild. He was a traditional romantic. Reality was never going to live up to exactly how he pictured it. Hey, what's up, man? He was always rushing to get into the scene. He was rushing to get out of the scene, to go somewhere next, even if he had nowhere to go. He was definitely searching for something. You were successful, and I am successful. And I'm wondering, are you happy? I know how hard it must have been for him to reach out to someone and be like, hey, man, I'm not doing well. Nothing feels better than going home. And nothing feels better than leaving home. The bittersweet curse. Travel isn't always pretty. You go away. You learn. You get scarred, marked, changed in the process. You inspire so many people with the show. You have a good karma. Good karma? I think so. Well... <laughs> <laughs> Some of you might ask, how is this food related? If I know.